Hi to all. So let's see how to make another double co double cone over this uh, quite complex complex boundary. So again, I have uh, inserted uh, the length of the edges, so we can see all the edge lengths. Um, let's activate a new layer where my conical shape will go, and let's start creating my mesh. Now these edges are quite short. This is two meters, three meters, two meters, three meters, and eight, nine meters. So we will start. We will make um, edges of uh, nearly 0 point, 0 0.5 meters. Uh, the mesh size. The mesh size 0 0.5 meters. So this is nine, eight meters. Instead of nine points, I will insert the double 9 and 9 18 points and start creating this first edge this is 2 2 meters I will make um, 6 points that m uh, this edge here I will make only 2 points I don't want uh, mesh points inside here and 4 and 3 meters <coughs> Uh, for one meter, we should insert four, but I will double it and put eight. <coughs> this edge here is um, eight meters, so eight means uh, nine points, nine and nine, eighteen. Here, this small edge, two points. This is uh, 3 meters, so f for a mesh of 1 meter, 4 points. I double the number of points to have half a meter. 2 points for this small edge, I don't want meshes inside this. And um, uh, this is, uh, we'll need 3 points for 1 meter, and I will double 3 points to 6 points. That one here. The top ring radius. 0 0.3, that's 0 0.4, 0 0.5, uh, slanted. Hmm. Uh, let me get this one and copy copy yeah I would like to copy even this one copy okay I'm going to fix the orientation of this uh, this middle cone here. Okay. Um, let's make the other conical shape. So recall, make conical shape, and. Um, mesh 18 points will be my first edge from here to here then two points this edge here four points for one meter I will double it to eight points this edge I don't want meshes inside that one so two points this one here needs three points, I will double it to six. This one eight would require nine points for one meter, uh, 18 for zero point meters. This one here, three points, that means six, three points for one meter mesh, six points for a half a meter mesh, and then two points. And the last one will be eight. 
click on the C to, co to close. Uh, now, in the conical tip, we want a slanted conical tip. And so this is my center, and this is the orientation of my cone. That's it. So, this is the boundary. We can see how all these are placed. Uh, let's look at the front side. <coughs> now, nah, this I've moved that, show the nodes. I want to fix these top nodes here. So, fix these. And if I look from top, I would like to select the top ring here, so I will use the select by circle. And open a circle here. And fix these. Okay. Um, the edges, let's put properties for the mesh, membrane, pre-contrained, and properties for the edges. Uh, the edges, we want them cable 16. Uh, uh, maybe these should be beam, linear, and uh, fixed. And maybe this middle, this middle one, we want it to be delete. I don't want that one. And um, these edges, this middle one here, this is not a beam, this is a cable, a nonlinear cable, and uh, form find deformable. And cable 10 millimeters and one as the internal file save and let's uh, run the form finding so this is uh, the shape get out of this. 